Um, let's go. Let's go to the team with a golden boot winner, or maybe a future golden boot winner. It depends on how you look at it. Oh. Is it Chicago? It is Chicago. <laughs> um, in the door for Chicago is Marin Haley Selassie on loan, Arnaud Sequet from Montpellier, Jeff Gall, uh, and Jonathan Dean. Out the door, Gaga Slanina, John Duran, Ivanov, Espinoza, uh, Sekulich, and Bornstein all out the door. To me, I need to see some goalkeeper depth uh i very much am excited to see chris brady because i believe this is his goal um but if he gets hurt you've only got spencer richie on the back i would i would like to see one more there i'd like to see a starting level right back um i don't see i don't see really too much of a way to get that right now with justin reynolds uh you need a tam level attacking midfielder um shakiri is is okay but I think if you could get a TAM level um, attacking midfielder, you can flex him out to the left wing, uh, Jairo Torres on the right, and go from there. Uh, and then they need a designated player number nine. Uh, you've got Casper Shabilko, which is a good TAM level, uh, and then two young players there. Uh, they are rumored to Huang Weijo, a striker for Olympiacos, who is a very, very active player for the South Korean national team did not go to the world cup. Um, but he's got 16 goals and 53 international appearances for them. Um, he transferred to Nottingham forest, went on loan to Olympiacos, uh, only has five appearances so far, but, uh, he played for Bordeaux from 19 to 22, uh, and had 29 goals and 94 appearances. So, uh, that is one of the rumors they have there. That would be the DP number nine I'm looking for. What else do you think? I, man, I, I don't like the way this team is shaped up right now. Um, Hater. I think, so they, they've brought in a couple of right backs in the off season. That I think they're going to try to, they're, they're going to fill in that right back spot. Uh, left back. I feel like they could probably get some more left back depth. All they have right now is Miguel Navarro. Um and midfield depth. I see Gaston Jimenez, I see Federico Navarro, who I think are fantastic for the midfield. But that's about it. Then it's a bunch of 17, 18, 19 year olds. So I see definitely need some more midfield players. Need some more left back. I really like the center back situation. Goalkeeper, I'm. I would say I'm in agreement. I think you give Chris Brady the goal just as you did Gaga, but yeah, I'll leave that for now. And then, if we want to jump into grades, I can keep going. Yeah, go ahead. Give me your grade. Let me hear what you got. I am not a fan of this window for them. I think that it's great that they capitalized and uh, got really good money for their players, John uh, Jan Duran. They got good money for Gagaslanina. They got really good money for, uh, and obviously Duran is a very recent one, so I'm not going to knock them too much for it. But they just have not spent that money at all. Slanina, you know, was sold a while back. Obviously, was just here, I think, on loan, and they just haven't reinvested the money. Obviously, like I'm not saying they need to have used it to get another goalkeeper because. I like that they're going with Chris Brady here, but this team just doesn't feel great on paper and they have all this money and they just seem to not be reinvesting it. I mean, they brought in their biggest signing, it seems like, is from a, a mid-table French team. A 30-year-old right back from a mid-table French team. So I just I feel uninspired by their window. I feel like they haven't done enough to bolster the team. I think there are good players in their attack who can be, you know, uh, still keep them somewhat competitive in games with, you know, like Chris Mueller, Shakiri, Shabilko, Fabian Herbers. But I, I think they need some help in the midfield. They need help in defense. And they just 
haven't done enough for me in this window. So I've got their window at a D plus. You are a hater. You wouldn't give an F to Vancouver, but you're going to give a D plus to Chicago. Hater. Um, I am removing my what they need at a uh, starting level right back because I I thought I had written down that Sequet was a left back, but he is not. He is a right back. So they have their starting right back, um, which is good. They still probably need a little bit of depth. I've got it at a C minus. Um, one playoff appearance in the last 10 years, an open designated player slot, like $40 million worth of transfer fee. And you've got crickets. Um, That's what I'm saying. It's so disappointing. I, I don't disagree, but you can't tell me that you're going to give a C minus to Vancouver, who have been the same amount of disappointing as Chicago. And then come out and, and bash Chicago like that. You don't get to do that to my boys in Chicago. Yeah, uh-uh. but Chicago ha- Chicago has the money. Vancouver hasn't sold anybody, and they're not sitting they on sell forty everybody. million. What do you spend. mean? But they're not sitting on forty million to spend. Anyways, um, I think they really need to push uh, for Huang Weijo. I think that's going to be tough. I know a lot of people want him, but um, I think they need to be the leaders in that in that group, um, and they need to get a, a another tan level attacker. Uh, go change this team around. 